Raghunata Deki Kaila Pranati Savana Saha Eka Viprahura Kailani Mantrana After seeing the deity of Lord Ramachandra, the descendant of King Raghu, the Lord offered his prayers and obeisances. Then a Brahmana invited the Lord to take lunch. Say Viprahama Nama Nirantaradaya Rama Rama Vina Anya Vani Nakaya. That Brahmana constantly chanted the holy name of Ramachandra. Indeed, but for chanting Lord Ramachandra's holy name, that Brahmana did not speak a word. I want to see one person, one sit back to shop people. Ram 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 Constant Ram 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 Ram. Kita rate Pansu Ram 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 Ram. Like that. It's constantly chanting like this. Anyway, it's very auspicious to chant. So he did not speak one word, it was constantly chanting, but this is a great devotee. Sayri na tanra gare rahe vikshakari, tanre kripa kari aage chali na gaurari. That day Lord Ramachandra remained there and accepted Prashada at his house. And after bestowing him upon him, mercy upon him in this way, the Lord proceeded ahead. So he took Prashada and blessed him. Kanda Shetri Tirtha Kailas Kanda Dharashana Trimadha Aila Kaha Dekhi Trivakrama Chaitanya Prabhu in South India too, so you see him all this place. At a holy place known as Kanda Shetra, Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu visited the temple of Skanda. From there he went to Trimadha, where he saw the Vishnu deity Trivikrama. Puna Siddha Vata Aila Sevi Pragare Sevi Prakrishna Namadaya Nirantare. After visiting the temple of Trivikrama, the Lord returned to Siddha Vata, where he again visited the house of the Brahmana, who was now constantly chanting the Hare Krishna Mahanapada. We were now chanting Hare Krishna. Previously Ram Kapta. What happened? Vikshakari Mahaprabhu Tanri Prashna Kaila. Kama Vipra E Tumara Kona Dosha Haila. After finishing his lunch there, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu asked the Brahmana, My dear friend, kindly tell me what is the position, what your position is now? Oh, sorry, not dosha, dasha, dasha hai. Purve tu mi nirantara laite rama nama, eve keme nirantara lao krishna nama. Formerly you are constantly chanting the holy name of Lord, and now you are constantly chanting the holy name of Krishna. What happened? Viprabhale ei tomara darshana prabhave toma deki gela mura adhana samhave The Brahmana replied, this is all due to your influencer. After seeing you, I have lost my lifelong practice. Balaya vada dhirama nama dhana amara toma deki krishna nama aira ekamara from my childhood, I have been chanting the holy name of Lord Ramachandra, but upon seeing you, I chanted the holy name of Lord Krishna just once. Say, Haite Krishna Nama Jiva Deva Shila, Krishna Nama Spure Rama Nama Dure Gala. Since then, the holy name of Krishna has tightly fixed upon my tongue. Indeed, I have since been chanting the holy name of Krishna, the holy name of Lord Ramachandra has gone far away. Palya kala hai te mora sava vari kahaya na me rama hai ma shasra kariya sanchaya. So, in childhood, I have been practicing the chanting Ram 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 from childhood. I was doing and I have been collecting the glories of the holy name from revealed scripture because he is feeling pleasure in that. So, he was collecting scriptural support for that. Ramande yogi no anande satyanande chidatmani. Iti Rama Pade Rash Param Brahma Vidhiyate. The Supreme Absolute Truth is called Rama because transcendental take pleasure in the unlimited true pleasure of the spiritual existence. This is the eighth verse of the Shatanama Stotra, Lord Ramachandra, which is found in Padma Purana. It's a quotation from Padma Purana. Another one. Shri Bhu Vajaka Shabdo Nacha Nivriti Vajaka Tayo Rai Kyam Param Brahma Krishna Vidhiyate. 
the word Krishna is the attractive feature of the Lord's existence and na means spiritual pleasure. When Krishna is added to the affix na, na, actually the na, therefore there is a dot below na. It becomes Krishna, which indicates the absolute truth. This is the verse of Mahabharata, Udyoga Bharva, the boy of He was chanting, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna. <laughs> Nothing wrong trying to pronounce exactly. This is from Mahabharata Udyut Parva 71.4. Param Brahma Duri Nama Samana Haila Puna Arasha Saiki Chubishesha Paila. As far as the holy name of Rama and Krishna are concerned, they are all on the equal level. But for further advance, we receive some specific information from revealed scripture. Rama Rame Ti Rame Ti Rama Rama Mano Rame Sahasya Nama Mistulyam Rama Nama Varanane Lord Shiva addressed his wife Durga as Varanama and explained, I chant the holy name of Rama, Rama, Rama and thus enjoy beautiful sound. This holy name of Ramachandra is equal to 1000 holy name of Lord Vishnu. This verse is from Briha, the Vishnu Sahasranama Sutra in the Uttar Khanda of the Padma Purana, again Padma Purana. 72.335, exact number is also there. Now, this Lord Shiva, Om Gyana Tikharandasya, Gyana Jana Shabakaya, Chakshu Vilitam Gena Tasmai Shri Guru Gena Nama Vishnu Padaya Krishna Krishna Yavutare Shri Mati Vakti Veda Tasmai Vina Namaste Saraswati Deve Gauravani Prasharane Vishayashashin Yavadi Pasha Tadeshadharane Jaru Shri Krishna Chaitanya Prabhu Nityananda Shri Advai Nekadadara Shivasati Gauravakta Vrinda Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Rama. The Lord Shiva, the great devotee of Lord Rama, and he constantly chants Rama Rama. This we come to know one more instance, Chaitanya Charitamata, when Haridas Thakur, when Durga Devi once comes to test Haridas Thakur. She also, previous to that, was prostitute tested. Now Durga Devi comes to test her. And she creates beautiful, Features in front of him, but he is not affected. He is chanting. So yes. he said, "Who are you? Actually, Brahma himself. <laughs> Who are you? And you are uh, like nobody can handle this. In the dead of night, a beautiful girl is showing features, and you are blissfully chanting." Then she says, "You have passed my test, but I want some blessing from you." And Durga Devi itself came to test you. My test now, business. And now I want to take Diksha from you. My husband has given me Ramana Diksha. Now you give me Krishna Nama Diksha. So like that. So there also it comes a lot. Shiva is always chanting the name of Rama. Here also it is repeat. What he is doing, you can't even go to the planet. You have to hear from scripture. No? Otherwise there is no access to it. Sahasranam nam punya nam triyavritya tu yat palam Eka Vrityad Krishnasya Namaikam Tad Prayachati The pious reserves derived from chanting the thousand name of Lord Vishnu three times can be attained by only one utterance of the holy name of Krishna. Purport. This verse in the Brahmata Purana is found in the Lagu Bhagavatam Vrita by Rupa Goswami. Simply by chanting the name of Krishna once one can attain the same result achieved by chanting the holy name of the Lord Rama. Holy name of Rama? Evaka Krishna me Rama hima apara Dhabilai te nari shunai tutara According to this statement of the Shastra, the glories of the holy name of Krishna are unlimited. Still, I could not chant the holy name. Please hear the reason for this. Iti deva rama tamra nama sukha pai Sukha pai rama nama ratri dinagai my worshipful Lord has the Lord Ramachandra and by chanting his holy name I received happiness. And because I received the happiness, I chanted the holy name Lord Rama day and night. Imagine so much pleasure is there in chanting God's name. Person can happily chant day and night. 
and continually chanting in Vaikuntha. No problem. Nothing that even stop that activity. Tumara Darshane Yave Krishna Nama Aila Ahara Mahima Tave Hidaya La Inya. By your appearance, Lord Krishna's holy name also appeared. At that time, the glory of the Krishna name awoke in my heart. Say Krishna to me, Saksha Iha Nirdharila Ete Kahi Pipra Pamura Charane Padila. The Brahmana continued, Sir, you are the Lord Krishna Himself. This is my conclusion. Saying this, the Brahmana fell down at the lotus feet of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Tanre Kipakari Prabhu Chalila Aradine Vridha Kashi Ashikaila Shiva Darshane. After showing mercy to the Brahmana, Lord Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu next day left and arrived at the Vridha Kashi where he visited the temple of Lord Shiva. Vridha Kashi present name is Vridha Chalam. It is situated in the southern Arko disk of the banks of the river Mani Mukha. This place is also known as Kala Haste Kala. Hastipura, Lord Shiva temple, there was worship for many years by Govinda, the cousin of Ravana Chari. Okay, anyways, the Lord, this is what we got brief here, that one says later also, Chitama proper clarifies. We don't say a Rama or Krishna are higher or lower than each other. Because the point is, it is the same person. It is not two persons. Advaita Machutama Nadi and you know, in the material world, we have the tendency somebody is higher, somebody is lower. Correct? It is the same objective, the difference is life. But still, Krishna chanting has special feature. It is just like you have different names. Some name is very personal to you. Okay? Personal. So, suppose, suppose somebody has a name, but mother, father, they take even different name. That is very sweet. Suppose somebody says you are Indian, that is also good. You are Mangalorean, that is also correct. But then you have personal name, you are very happy when somebody takes that name. But somebody takes a name which is taken as mother or a wife, that is even more sweeter. Very personal. So Krishna is taken by Yashoda. They are very exalted, very, it's like very intimate sacred text. So that, whatever reason, that's what, what we can understand. Anyway. It is said Krishna tried to summarize the scripture, but the devotee is telling very nice. Because then what do you do? You put your idea there in the name of summary. You should just repeat what the Shastra say. When you go to the spiritual world, you realize what has been there. It's a very advanced topic. But anyway, scripture say chanting Krishna's name once is equal to chanting Lord Rama's name thrice, which is equal to chanting Vishnu's name thousand times. Many people do know Vishnu Sarasana. You chant Rama over. Uh-huh. You chant for two hours, Rama over. I chant Krishna, it is like chanting Vishnu Sahasranama three times. But anyway, chanting Vishnu Sahasranama is also nice. It's not that it is. Chanting name of Lord remains absolute. But there is a variety of names. But then, when we are in the metal world, what we are trying to do, just like you know, Sakya Rasa, Vasala Rasa, Vasala Rasa is higher than Sakya Rasa. Then you see, oh, this devotee is Vasila Rasa. He is higher than this devotee. Eh? Why are you doing all this nonsense? There is no comparison like that in the spiritual world. Not higher and lower. Just different uh, flavor. Uh, but what we do is that we put a material mind there and try to make things higher and lower. We should not do like that. It is a spiritual domain, absolute domain. Everything is absolute there. And we should not put relative domain in the material world. Now there is one more Rama devotee, Lord Chaitanya means that comes much later. That will come after he meets Venkata Pata.
That this is 178th verse, Chaitanya Charitamita. Uh, yeah, uh, Chaitanya Plus Tour of South India. Dakshina Mathura Aila Kama Koshi Haite, Taha Deka Haila Eka Ramana Saite. When Sri Chaitanya arrived at the southern Mathura from Kama Koshi, he met a Brahmana. Purple Vashir Prabhu. Southern Mathura is presently known as Madhura. Madhura is situated at the banks of Bhajali River. This is a place of pilgrimage specially meant for devotees of Lord Shiva, therefore it is called Shaiva Shetra. And it's a place where Lord Shiva is worshipped. So quick description. Sevi Pramaha Prabhu Ke Kailani Mantrana Rama Bhakta Sevi Pra Virakta Mahajana the Brahmana who met Chaitanya Mahaprabhu invited, Shri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu invited the Lord to his home. This Brahmana was a great devotee and authority of Lord Sri Ramachandra. He was all a detached of material activities. Krita Malaya Snana Kari Aya Dhanra Gare Viksha Keti Vena Vipra Pakana Inkare After bathing in the river Krita Mala, Shri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu went to the Brahmana's house to take lunch. But he saw the food was unprepared because the Brahmana had not cooked it. So, sannyasi means people invite for lunch. He went. But when he went there, something surprises. Food is not cooked. Lunch time is gone. Mahaprabhu kahetan reshuna mahashaya madhyana kal haila ke ne pakana hi haya. Seeing the Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu said, My dear sir, please tell me why you are not cooked. It is already known. What happened? Viprakai Prabhu Mora Aryane Vasati Pakera Samadri Vane Nami Le Samprati. The Brahmana is in Samadhi on Lord Rama staying in that Ashok Vatika where Ravana came to kidnap. He is in that Samadhi on Lord Rama staying in forest with Lakshmana and Sita. That is why now he is speaking on that. Brahmana replied, My dear Lord, we are living in the forest. Forest means he is on the Leela Smaran. The Lord Rama is with Sita and Lakshmana in the forest. Now Ashwapadika is different. Ashwapadika where Sita was kidnapped and killed. It was a place where they were staying. Dandakaranya forest. So, where they were staying. Anyway, My dear Lord, we are living in the forest. For the timing, we cannot get all the ingredients for cooking. He is not in a forest, he is in a city, but still Madura. Uh, still Madura is a very big town. Yeah? He is in a city, but he is in that Leela Swan. That's why he is speaking like that. Vanyasha ka phala mula ani me lakshmana Tabe sita kari bina paka prayojana When Lakshmana brings all the vegetable fruits and roots from the forest, Sita will do all the necessary cooking. You see, India was so great. Now this is 500 years ago and what is today? Where you will find somebody in Leela's corner of Lord Rama who is reading Shastra and everybody goes home, open TV and hear nonsense. Okay? But previously people will read Shastra and their heart will be so purified. So we can't even speak like this. He said, Lakshmana brings the vegetable, Sita will do all the cooking. He is in that. Tahanrayu upashana shuni prabhu tushta haila Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu was very much satisfied to hear about the Brahmana's method of worship. Finally, the Brahmana hastily made arrangement for cooking. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is in the Adhyatmic Shadra, but he has to eat. If he wants, he can eat the whole universe. Material body has hunger, spiritual body there is nothing, but he is giving seva to him. Prabhu Bhiksha Kaila Dine Ratriti Abrahare. Nirvena sevi prabhupava sakare. Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu took his lunch at about 3 o'clock, but the Brahmana being very sorrowful faster. So by 3 o'clock, previously people used to generally, I think, uh, eat big lunch. And we don't hear he is being invited in morning or evening. Lunch, no. 
a nice period. Even villagers used to do like that, correct? They will go to the farm, one big lunch they will have. Previously it was different. Sri Chaitanya took his lunch at about 3 o'clock. It's very late. Here by 3 o'clock we have third meal. Mm -hmm. But Brahmana being very sorrowful fasted. He did not eat anything. He is doing Prata. Prabhu kahe vipra kane kara upavasa kena eta dukkha kene kahara karaha utasa. While the Brahmana was fasting, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu asked him, Why are you fasting? Why are you so unhappy? Why are you so worried? What is your problem? Vipra kahe jivana mora nahi prayojana agni jale prave shri achari va jivana. The Brahmana replied, I have no reason to live. I shall give up my life by entering either fire or water. I can't live anymore now. Jagat Mata Mahalakshmi Sita Thakurani Raksha Shespashi Sparshi Latande Ihakane Shuni. My dear sir, Mother Sita, the mother of the universe, the supreme god of the fortune, is the mother of the universe and the supreme god of the fortune. She has been touched by demon Ravana and I am troubled upon hearing this news. He is in that full samadhi of Ravana. E shari ram dhari vare kavuna yuyaya E dukke jwale deha prana nahi yaya So due to my unhappiness I cannot continue living. Although my body is burning, my life is not leaving. He is in so much difficulty. I am not dying. Rabu kahe e bhava na na kari yara Pandita haya ke na na kara vichara Shri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu replied, please do not think in this way any longer. You are a learned Pandita. Why don't you consider the case? Ishwara Preya Shri Sita Chidananda Murti Prakita Indreya Tanre Dekhidana Ishakti Shri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu continued, Sita Devi, the dearmost wife of the Supreme Lord Ramachandra certainly has a spiritual form of bliss. No one can see her with the metal by eyes, for no materialist has such power. Svashi vara karya achuta na paya darshana sitara akriti maya harila ramana. To say nothing of touching Mother Sita, a person whose material senses cannot even see her. When Ravana kidnapped her, he kidnapped only her material illusory form. Ramana Asite Shita Antardana Kaila Ramane Ramahema Sita Ramahema As soon as Ramana arrived before Sita, she disappeared and just to teach, cheat Ramana, she sent an illusory material form. Aprakita Vastunahe Prakita Gochara Veda Purane Te Ekare Nirankahe Nirankara Spiritual substance has never been the jurisdiction of the middle conception. This is always the wordings from Vedas and Puranas, as stated in the Katha Upanishad. Na sam dashe rupam asya na chakshusha pashati kasya nayenam vidamani shamana saviku kalpito ya e tat vidur amrita te mavaruti naiva vacha namanasa praptum shakyo na chakshusha. Spirit is not within the jurisdiction of materialized words of mind. Similarly, Shrimad Bhagavatam 10.84.13 states, Yasyata buddhi kurna bethi dhatu ke swati kalatra desha bhoma ejati yati vita buddhi sallena kareche janesha vaginesha saiva koho kara. A human being identifies the body made of three elements with his self, who consider the byproducts of his body to be skin smell, who consider the land of his birth worshipable. When he goes to the place of pilgrimage, simply to take his bath rather than to meet a man of transcendent knowledge there, is to be considered like an ass or a cow. There are some Vedic statements about spiritual substance. Spiritual substance cannot be seen by the unintelligent because they do not have eyes or mentality to see the spirit soul. Consequently, they think that there is no such thing as spirit. But the followers of the Vedic injunction take this information from the Vedic statement such as the verse of the Katha Upanishad, Shrimad Bhagavatam quoted above. Vishwasha karaha tumi amara vachane punarapi kubhavana naka 
Hari Amani. Shri Chaitanya was an assured the Brahmana. Have faith in my words. I do not burden your mind any longer with this misconception. Perfect. This is the process of spiritual understanding. Achinte khalu ye bhava na tam sarke na yojaya. We should not try to understand things beyond a material conception by argument and counter argument. Mahajalo yeni katha sapantaha. We have to follow the course of the great authorities coming down in the parampara system. If we approach a bona fide acharya and keep faith in his words, spiritual realization will be easy. easy. Otherwise, we can keep imagining and then make argument counter argument. Just accept the words of the acharya. The life is such. Prabhura vacha nave pre haila vishwasha Bhojana karila haila jiva nera asha Although the Brahmana was fasting, yet faith in the words of Sri Chaitanya accepted food. In this way, his life was saved. Otherwise, he was going to die. Tanre ashwashiya prabhu karila gavana Grita malaya asthana kariyaila durvashana after thus assuring the Brahmana, Sri Chaitanya proceeded further into southern India and finally arrived at Durvashana, where he bathed in the river Kritamala. Presently, the Kritamala River is known as River Agai. This river has three tributaries, namely Shurili, Varainadi, and Bhatila Gundu. The river Kritamala is also mentioned in the Shivan Bhagavad Gita 11.39 by the sage Karamadana. Now, something more happens, I'll jump. Viriprasamaya Shunita. So just a few one or two verses more. That was yeah, the 197. I am just going to 198. One I just read the translation. At Durvashana Sri Chitra visited temple of Lord Ramachandra. And on the hill known as Mahindra Shaila, he saw Lord Parashurama. Sri Chitrava then went to Setubanga Ramesha, where he took path in the place known as Dhenu Stita. From there he visited Rameshwara temple and then took a rest. There among the Brahmana, Sri Chitrava could listen to the Kuma Purana, wherein was mentioned the chaste woman's narration. So here where is he? He is in. Setubanda, Rameshwara, there he heard. There among the Brahmana, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, Viprasamaya Shunnetane Puruma Purana, Tare Madhe Aila Prati, Vrata Upakhyana. There among the Brahmana, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu listened to the Kuru Purana, where he was mentioned in the Chase Woman's narration. Shri Bhaksana Saraswati Thakur remarks that only two khandas of the Puru Purana are now available, namely Purva Khanda and Uttar Khanda. Sometimes it is said the Purva Purana contains 6,000 verses, or originally Purva Purana contains 17,000 verses. According to Shri Bhagavan, there are 70,000 verses in Purva Purana, which is one of the 18 Mahapuranas. The Purva Purana is considered the 15th of these Mahapuranas. Many books are lost. Pati Vrata Shri Romani Janaka Nandini Jagate Ramata Sita Ramera Krini Shivati Sita Devi, the mother of the three words and the wife of Lord Ramachandra. Among chaste women, she is supreme and she is the daughter of King Janaka. Ramana Deki Yasita Leila Leila Nirasharana Ravana Haitai Agni Kaila Sita Ke Avarana. When Ravana came to kidnap Mother Sita, she saw him and she took shelter of the fire god Agni. And the fire god covered the body of Mother Sita. And in this way, she was protected from the hand of Ravana. Maya Sita Ravana Nila Shunila Akhyane Shuni Mahaprabhu Haila Anandita Mane. Upon hearing of Guru Purana, how Ravana had kidnapped a false form of Mother Sita, Sri Chaitanya became very much satisfied. Sri Tala Nara Kilane Napa Parvati Rasthani 
Maya Shita Diya Agni Vanch Vanchila Ramane The fire god Agni took away real Sita and brought her to the place of Parvati god Azurga and usually form of other Sita was then delivered to Ramana and this way Ramana was cheated. Raghu Nata Ashiya Ve Ramane Marila Agni Pariksha Diti Yave Sita Re Anila After Ramana was killed by Lord Ramachandra, Sita Devi was brought for the fire and tested. Tabe Maya Sita Agni Kari Antarana Satya Sita Ani Dila Rama Vityamana When the usually Sita brought before the fire by Lord Ramachandra, the fire god made the illusory form disappear and delivered the real Sita to Lord Ramachandra. Shunina Prabhura Anandita Hailemana Ramadasa Vipreraka Kahaila Asmarana when Sri Chaitanya heard the story, he was very much pleased. They remembered the word of the Ramadasa Vipra, same girl. His name was Ramadasa Vipra, same dude. Ei Sava Siddha Dasuni Prabhura Ananda Haila Brahma Nera Sane Mahi Sei Patra Nila. Indeed, when Sri Chaitanya heard this conclusive statement of Guru Purana, he felt great happiness. And after asking the Brahmana's permission, he took the position of those manuscript leaves. Nutana Bhupatra Leka Pustaka Devaila Prati Dila Gipuratana Patri Magi Nila. Since the Kuru Pranam was very old, the manuscript was also very old. Shitra took the position of the original leaves to, uh, in order to have direct evidence. The text was copied in new leaves in order that the Purana be different. Previously, the Purana will only be available in temples or outside. A handwritten, no printing at that time, on the leaves or whatever they had. So he said, make a fresh copy, an original one. He said, this I will show to him. This is very old leaves. This you know, brings more authority. Patralana puna dakshina motura haila Ramadasa viprese patra anidila Chitrava returned to Southern Matura Madurai and delivered the golden, so the original manuscript of Puru Purana to Ramadasa vipra. Sita. Now these are the words. Sita yadito varpanis chaya sita aji janat tam jahara dasha griva sita vahani purangata pariksha samaye vahani chaya sita viveshasa vahani sita samuniya tat purastar aninaya. These are the two verses taken from Kuru Parana. When he was petitioned by Mother Sita, the fire god Agni brought forth the illusory form of Sita and Ravana, who had ten heads, kidnapped the false Sita, the original Sita that went to the abode of fire god. When the Lord Ramachandra tested the body of Sita, it was the false illusory Sita that entered the fire. And at that time, fire god brought the original Sita from the abode and delivered her to Lord Ramachandra. The two verses are taken from Kuru Purana. Patra Pana Vipra Haila Anandita Mana Prabhu Raja Ranadari Karane Kandana Ramadas Vipra was very much pleased to receive the original leaf manuscript of Pura Purana and he immediately fell down before the lotus feet of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and began to cry. Imagine how much respect for the scripture. Scripture says this means this is the way. Prabhupada also had the same respect. If Prabhupada tells us, teach this scientist. What? That the solar eclipse, neural eclipse is not because of what they say, it is because of Rahu Ketu. You have to do that. They told BI. One of the things BI has been told is this. Teach them this. Imagine that is called perfect faith in the scriptures. Perfect. This is the way it has told it is like that. Prove it. They don't know how to see it from. Hmm. On the list I saw. Viprakaye Tomi Saksha Shira Gunandana Sanyasira Veshamore Niladarashana after receiving the manuscript, the Brahmana, being very much pleased, said, Sir, you have brought Lord Ramachandra himself. Sir, you are Lord Ramachandra himself, and I have come in the dress of a sannyasi to give me audience. Mahadukha haita mora kalira nistara aji mora kare viksha kara angi kara My dear sir, you have delivered me from a very unhappy condition. I request to take your lunch at my place. 
please accept this invitation. Because last time you could not cook properly, it was of some other samadhi. Again, one more time, I'll give you a nice match. Mana, mano dukke bhala vaksha nadi la saidine, mora bhagya bhara pi palu dara hashane. Due to my mental distress, I cannot give you a very nice lunch the other day. Now, by good fortune, you have come again to my home. Eta vali sehivi prasuke pa kakaila, uttama prakara prabhu ke viksha karela. Saying that the Brahmana very happily cooked food and a first class dinner was offered to Sri Chitramaprabhu. Sehi ratri tahan rahi tahane ki pakari. Pandya Deshi Tama Pandya Gila Gaura Hari. Sri Chaitanya passed at night in the house of Ramana, then again showing him mercy, Lord started toward Tamra Pandya in Pandya Desh. Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu ki. Sri Chaitanya Chaitanya Mahaprabhu ki.